It seems there's a new twist to the Uta Pau story after the cabinet postponed any decision on a new yes. stay. Mm -hmm. And it sounds quite strange to me that the foreign minister, Kun Surapong, is giving the cabinet or the government an ultimatum saying that if you know they don't decide by a certain date soon, there's Tuesday. Yes, NASA will withdraw its request to use yes. Uta Pau. What, what actually is happening? Um, I'm still confused myself. Uh, <laughs> this is the most uh, dramatic um, statement by the foreign minister. Mm -hmm. He said that if the government cannot make a clear cut stand, mm -hmm. or the, if the cabinet refused to endorse the request of NASA, yeah. right, uh, next Tuesday, the Americans will walk. <laughs> So um, we, we believe that uh, we have two, uh, two theories here. Yeah. Uh, the first one being that Kunsura uh, Pong may be trying to put pressure on the cabinet, mm -hmm. which uh, uh, we saw yesterday seemed to be under a lot of pressure mm -hmm. to stay away from this controversy. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe the government think that it is too sensitive a political period to be involved in anything like that. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. He might be uh, wanting to put some kind of pressure on the cabinet so that it could make a decision by next Tuesday. Mm -hmm. uh, a more likely theory yeah. is that maybe uh, Foreign Minister Sir Pong is trying to get a graceful way out of the whole thing by saying that you know next uh -huh. week uh, no decision so uh, nothing is happening. So you mean the whole deal could be just uh, cancelled? Yes and then he can uh, deflect the blame to all the critics uh, of this project. <laughs> this is uh, the second theory here. No, I doubt it because the NASA project is not that urgent because mm -hmm. the clouds that they're supposed to be uh, surveying mm -hmm. uh, will not disappear anytime soon. The reason he gave today is that the, uh, the Americans will have to come and, and observe the yep. readiness of the Uta Power Air Base yep. uh, in uh, uh, and, uh, August and September, which means that all the transportation of equipment, the arrival of uh, personnel, we have to be completed in, uh, in June or July. So uh -huh. uh, this is what uh, Dr. Pong said, mm -hmm. which means that if this thing, the cabinet decides to to hear the critics and allow parliamentary debate on oh, this uh -huh. controlling, there will be no time for the American to do all the uh, mm -hmm. preparations. Well, that makes it all the more suspicious if that you know, mm -hmm. is the case, because I think the use of Uta Pau is so controversial that whether the constitution requires it or not, the government should raise it in parliament. Exactly, I, I agree with that totally. Mm -hmm. Even if it uh, doesn't fall into Article 190 of the constitution, mm -hmm. it doesn't hurt for the government to just put it uh, out for, tr for, for the sake of transparency. Especially if it has nothing to hide as it claims. Right, and also uh, I, I don't know why it is so urgent for the American to uh, issue this kind of... Uh, no, I think the foreign minister would have to tell mm -hmm. NASA to make the statement, not through the foreign minister. If mm -hmm. a deadline has actually been set, mm -hmm. then NASA should make a statement saying, this is the reason why we need an answer by next Tuesday. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, to me, I think the, uh, the government itself doesn't want this thing to go to, to parliament. Mm -hmm. It will be too sensitive to discuss it in Parliament. Mm -hmm. Even if, uh, uh, for one thing, that, uh, to, to admit mm -hmm. that this thing has to go to Parliament is an embarrassment. That's one thing. Yeah. But to debate it actually in Parliament could be uh, very explosive. Actually. Well, they can make it a confidential session or secret session because mm -hmm. the law allows that. But mm -hmm. if it goes into a confidential session, then it will raise more suspicion. Then right. Uh, now, kind of now the, the opposition come a lot from the public as much as from the Democrat Party. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. uh, I think the Uta Pau issue has become unnecessarily a hot issue because it, it has been transparent and clearly explained from the beginning that this would not become a, a real serious political issue.